While coronavirus de deaths in Michigan continue to rise, most have been in southeast Michigan. Even so, Kent County's medical examiner says examiner says his office is prepared for whatever the future brings. 13 on your side's John Hogan has more on what preparations are in place. All government bodies prepare for the worst and hope for the best. Kent County Medical Examiner Dr. Stephen Cole says Kent County is not unique in that regard. But uh, the county has purchased a couple of refrigerated trucks in case uh, we are overwhelmed with uh, deceased folks with COVID. Cole said a local ice rink has also been made available should there be a need. That, of course, is not the case at present. Only a handful of deaths in Kent County have been attributed to coronavirus. Well, nobody knows what the surge will be like over here in West Michigan. But just in case it is large, then we want to be prepared and not uh, get caught uh, without sufficient space to store these people. Cole has conducted more than 10,000 autopsies in his career. The coronavirus pandemic has not contributed to that count. We haven't autopsied any known COVID cases. Usually someone with COVID, if they die of it, they've already been diagnosed and they're usually in the hospital and their death is expected. Cities like New York have been overwhelmed with coronavirus deaths. There's refrigerated more trucks parked on the streets. That thankfully is not the case in Grand Rapids. The reason to have refrigerated trucks at hand is if the surge becomes huge here and our capacity to store bodies that have not yet been claimed by the families or picked up by the funeral homes in case our capacity gets overwhelmed, we have to have some place to put them. Cole says he is hopeful that social distancing and stay at home orders will help limit the number of deaths. I think the vast majority of people that contract this virus are going to survive. But of course, the at risk people such as we have seen in our county are those that are quite elderly and particularly those uh, with additional uh, comorbidities such as emphysema, heart failure, cancer. In Michigan, stay-at-home orders have been extended through the end of the month. In Grand Rapids, John Hogan, 13 on your side.